shaved ice. We're testing three different types of shaved ice machines. One hand cranked one and two electronic ones. There's so many different types of shaved ice, but the one that I'm used to eating is called pinsu. It's the Korean style. It's so delicious. My mom used to make it for me growing up, and she used to top our pinsu with ice cream, and it was the best part. Today, I'm looking for really beautiful, fluffy shaved ice. The first machine I'm gonna test is this guy. I think I used this like 25 years ago. From my memory, it worked really well, especially for the price. This is like $23, super cheap and affordable. This guy comes with this little plastic tube so you can freeze your ice. Basically, you're placing your big ice cube in the cylinder, closing this, and then you'll just like hang crank it. Quite simple. It's like a workout. And from that, one block of ice, I get this much shaved ice. It's almost like too like chippy. It's not fluffy enough. I want fluff, I want snow. If you can chew the ice, that means it's not good flakes. You want it to just immediately melt. No. I feel like the blade in this and the space between the gap just makes the ice too chunky. I was considering getting this machine to do table-side shaved ice at my restaurants, uh, but I'm not sure if this is the quality that I want to use for the restaurant, so moving on to the next. This is your classic snow cone machine, which is very different than shaved ice, so I'm a little bit concerned that this is most likely going to be just not the product that I'm looking for. It doesn't come with a mold, so you'll just be putting regular ice in this compartment and then it will shave it for you and mind you this one is electronic and your ice will shave directly into this box but what's cool about this is that you don't like need a bowl or anything and it's actually kind of fun and it's really cute it looks like you know a mini carnival happening you want to add the ice first what is this slow Already, you see like huge chunks of ice. I know that this is a snow cone maker and not a shaved ice machine, but I was curious to see if the ice would be fluffy. When your ice does that, no. I am most curious and excited for this one because it costs $108 and it calls itself the fluffy ice machine. So this one also comes with the mold. So to unlock, you twist and pull up, place the ice in. Okay, so speed-wise, really quick. That was literally like two seconds. I'm disappointed. It's clumpy, it's chunky. So I realized that the blade needs to be as retracted as possible. So you want to be just scratching the surface of the ice. So I have it on that setting. And we'll see if it makes a different product. Okay. All right. You see that the ice actually built up. That's like what I want. It's, it's more fluffy, you can tell. Uh, but I'm gonna taste it and see. Mm-hmm and it's not as crunchy. It melts pretty immediately. Super excited to try the milk because I feel like not only the flavor, but it'll just be so snowy and beautiful. It looks beautiful. You see how it's building up like a mountain? That's kind of like what I want to see immediately. Ta-da! There's no like, chunky ice particles. It's moving when I flip it. Melt immediately. This is legit. Yes! Next, we're gonna build the actual pingsu. Mmm. That bite is just like worth it. It's worth it. 
We love this. The other two machines, the ice is a little bit too coarse. For the $23 hand crank machine, it's not too bad because it's super cheap. But I think that if you want the real true experience of shaved ice, you should definitely splurge and try this guy out because it is pretty amazing. For more product reviews like this, check out our friends at The Verge. But one of the most fun things to ride with an electric motor in it is an electric skateboard. And believe it or not, the market's actually grown enough over the last few years that some of the